Hello everyone, today we will solve some more numerical problems related to poison bracket. Here the first problem is that we have to calculate the poison bracket of the magnitude of the position vector and the magnitude of the momentum. You know that the position vector is defined as xi plus yz plus zk. Here xyz are the components along xyz axis, ijk are the unit vectors. So magnitude of the position vector will be x square plus y square plus z square to the power 1 by 2. Similarly, momentum is defined as pxi plus pyz plus pzk. Here px, py, pz are the momentum component along x, y and z axis. So magnitude of the momentum will be written as px square plus py square plus pz square to the power 1 by 2. Now let us say this is considered function u and this is considered function v. Now here you can see that x, y, z are present in u and similarly p, x, p, y, p, z are present in v. So the position bracket will be in such form del u over del x, del v over del p, x minus del u over del p, x, del v over del x in bracket plus del u over del y del v over del p y minus del u over del p y del v over del y in bracket plus del u over del z del v over del p z minus del u over del p z del v over del z bracket close now when we put all these values of the differentiations like del u over del x del v over del p x del v over del p x del v over del x and similarly del u over del y, del v over del p y, del u over del p y, del v over del y, del u over del z, del v over del p z, del u over del p z, del v over del z. Then we will have finally a relation like uh, here x upon r and then p x upon p plus y upon r, p y upon p plus z upon r, p z upon p. Now we can write it as x p x plus y p y plus z p z upon r p. Now x p x plus y p y plus z p z it can be written as dot product of position vector r and momentum vector. So it will be vector r dot vector p and it is magnitude of the position vector and it is magnitude of the momentum vector. Now you know that when a vector is divided by its modulus, it becomes the unit vector. So it will be written as unit vector R and unit vector P. Now there are some very important properties of the Poisson bracket. The first property is that we have already discussed it that the Poisson bracket does not commute or uv is equal to minus vu. If there is a constant with any function in Poisson bracket then it can be taken out from the whole of the Poisson bracket. Similarly if there are two constants then both can be taken out from the Poisson bracket. Now the fourth property is that u plus v w here w will first operate with u and then will operate v so it becomes u w plus v w. Similarly, in case of multiplication, first W will be with V and then W will be with U. So, here V is taken as out. So, it will be U W in Poisson bracket plus U V W in Poisson bracket. Similarly, for the four variables A, B, C and D, it will be written as like A, then B, C, D plus b a c d means the first value is here a b so first here we will write a then the rest value b c d and then we will write the next value b and then the rest value in poison bracket a c d now we can open it as b c d right so here first we will take here c as out so it will become a c then it will be written as bd then we will take here d as out so ad will be here and then in poison bracket there will be bc similarly for this 
for example bracket b a c d here a c d is present bracket so first c will be taken out so it will be b c a d then d will be taken out from the poison bracket and it will be b d poison bracket a c now we will discuss about the double poison bracket the double poison bracket is written in two brackets first b and c it is in poison it is one poison bracket and then this value will be written in the poison bracket with a so here when we solve the double poison bracket first we will evaluate the bc poison bracket and then we will evaluate the result which we have obtained uh, by this bc poison bracket with a now there is a very important property related to double poison bracket and uh, this is called as the jacobi identity it is like a b c in double poison bracket plus b c a in double poison bracket plus c a b in double poison bracket their sums will be equal to zero now here you have to note that there is maintain a cyclic order means a b c then b c a plus c a b it is called as the jacobi identity now there is uh, the poison theorem if u and v are constant of motion then the poison bracket gives other constant of motion here let us say u and v are the two functions and u is constant and v is also constant then poison bracket of the constant functions will be constant here you can understand it like that let us say the x component of the angular momentum is constant and py component of the generalized momenta is constant then poison bracket of lx py will be equal to pz and it will also be a constant quantity thank you